Alright guys, welcome back to GTA 5. We are on episode something. I don't know yet. You'll see you'll see by the title. Um but uh we're trying to go to Frank we're trying to do uh not Franklin but um Lester's job. We're trying to do Lester's job. We're gonna steal his Porsche right here. And uh we are going to try to do the Lester job, but they keep on telling me I have to I have to change into a suit or something like that to be able to do this job, which I want to be able to do this job. It would be really, really nice to do it. This is, this is a really nice Porsche right here. I really do like it. I love it. So, and yeah, break the front of my damn Porsche, bitch. Come on, let's do this. That was the first one you do in the campaign, in the single player. Not single player, I'm doing single player, but this is what you go to do your character. And I, I parked right in front of it, but I went to the wrong thing. Um, do you have any suits? Uh, no, you don't. So this is not the place that I need to be in. So let's try... Let's try these guys. I don't know what the shoe is for. Alright, well, we kind of jumped onto the wrong wrong thing here, and we're going to have to dodge cars now. Damn. Well, I know what we're going to do now. <laughs> we're going to jump that ramp here in oh. just, a, just a few minutes. Really, bitch? Really? Oh yeah! Fix yourself! Go! Go! Oh, it failed. Alright, let's go. Alright, let's get back on track. Let's get back on the mission. <sighs> you got lucky, buddy. Love this Porsche, man. I wish I could keep it, but I'm not gonna be able to. It really sucks. If I could darn drive right. Might be able to do something. Is this the one I just came from? No. Alright. Oh, now you want to show the door. Okay. This is fancy. Let's see if we can find anything fancy in here. No. Oh. Bitch, you really suck. I'm sorry. I thought. Uh, so where is a very uh, fancy high end? I don't know where a fancy high end is. Let's go there and find out then. Hmm. We're holding on to the dream. That dream is luxury. And a gas guzzling luxury car created in a nation that's ninety five. So that wasn't a fancy high-end restaurant thingy, not restaurant, but clothing line at all. So we're gonna we're we're, we're domestic to do this to do this uh, this Lester job. I, I just know it, but um, I got I gotta find a a, fan, a fancy uh fancy place to to shop. Really, you're just gonna hit me? 
even though I hit them. Alright, now, well, there we go. I'm not gonna pay this meter. I'm just, just not, nope. I didn't do anything. It wouldn't mean. Okay, thank you. All right, we found us a nice little fancy. Oh wow! For the nine hundred dollars. I really like the white one though. Ooh, purple looks pretty good. You got any suits that aren't? Expensive? Should we go with the black though? I don't know. Let's let's go look over here. See what we can find. Yeah, might as well go with the white one. Go with the white one. Oh, uh, right, there we go. Four thousand dollars. Thank you, ma'am. Oh, we gotta get a hat. We gotta get a hat. Where are the hats? No hats? Really? Really? No hats? Wow. You suck. Alright, well, we found what we got, so now we look really fancy. Now we can go to Lester, which is what we're going to do. Yeah, I want Lester. Alright, let's go do Lester now. Keep your head out of the gutter. I didn't mean it like that. Alright. So we are heading to Lester now. Which is really nice. And I missed my turn. Huh. Did I just hit my nuts and on that sign and survive? Did did I? I'm gonna have to go back and look at that. Shit. That was actually pretty pretty nice. I didn't know I was going that fast to throw myself out of the windshield. That's what I get for not wearing a seatbelt, huh? Yeah. Um, so can we make it? Yes, we can. It's green. <laughs> Sorry, didn't mean to kill you. Love you. Well, I know that song's copyrighted. I think my driving is getting better. I'll be very shocked if it is. I did not mean to kill that person. Or did I? Alright, there we go. Alright, there we go. the hell is this place? Garment factory. I needed a job that didn't require me to do anything apart from uh, paying taxes. Oh, it's my turn to walk. Oh, I didn't know. Okay, listen. Shh, shh, shh. What do you got? The Holy Grail. The Union Depository. And they say it cannot be hit. <laughs> Hasn't been yet. Look. I just owe some Mexican hood a couple million bucks to erect his girlfriend's house. I don't need to go crazy here. Which Mexican? Martin Madrazo. He's not supposed to be very nice. Oh, when I met him, he was charming. <laughs> so what do you think? Oh, um, let's see. Either we hit a bank in the sticks or we do a store. <coughs> Which do you like? Well, <clears throat> store's usually easier. But I gotta make a big take. Well, gem as it is, then. Let's go to Vangelico, buy ourselves an engagement ring. Oh, we're gonna need a crew. I can round up some of the old guys. There are no old guys. Moses, uh, ironically, he found Jesus. Uh, all those Irish crazies, they mostly just disappeared. That crew from the south, they all went down. There was, uh, an Eastern European guy making moves in Liberty City, but <coughs> he went quiet. All right. Well, we're gonna need a crew. You got any contacts in LS or not? I've been working with someone, but they're too unpredictable. I'll have to reach out to some other guys. What's wrong with my Porsche? <coughs> Why can't we take mine and I see it a parking spot? Thank you. So lovely. The jewelers is on Little Portola. 
That was real nice of him, wasn't it? Your FIB buddies, they uh, know you're back in business? FIB buddies? What are you talking about? I checked out the WPP thing. Doesn't look like any WITSEC program I'm aware of. Well, for starters, they, uh, they don't put witnesses up in multi-million dollar... I'm gonna go ahead and put the word caption on, because just to help you guys out... If I knew how to do it. Oh, uh, snap. Subtitles. Shins and Rockford Hills. Well, maybe they thought this go. would be the best cover. In Let's most witnesses don't transfer five-figure sums into a particular FIB agent's bank account every month. Of course, the money gets moved around and washed through a number of fronts, but the trail is there. Deposits and withdrawals, the same sum every month. Agent Dave Norton, white middle-aged divorcee, unremarkable career, except for one incident, the shooting of a notorious stick-up man, Let's Michael Town. Yeah, 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 all right. Lester, I'm very impressed. Look, uh, we can talk about this another time. But take these glasses. My eyesight's fine. They're fitted with a camera and a radio relay. I'm gonna run the operation from the car while you're in the store getting what we need. Okay, that worked out. Okay, let's get this done. We're going from here? No. That doesn't help. Go inside the store. Okay. Oh, go to the yellow dot. You reading me? Mm-hmm. Okay. We need shots of the security features, the alarm system, ventilation, cameras. Alright. I know they had small dicks, but damn. All that sucking and I ain't even getting the job? We don't need to scope out the street. Go inside. Yeah, next hey, time we'll put holes in the car. Sir, thank you. Talk to you. The later. alarm keypad is on the left when you come in, uh, on the wall by the side door. By the side door. Glasses are live. Shoot away. Ah, okay. That's their alarm. Uh, can you get me an air vent in one of the cameras? Great, you got the security camera and the ventilation in that shot. Good work. Now speak to the assistant and see if there's anything else we need to know. Hey, beautiful. I need to pick up a little something for the woman in my life. But well, one of them. Sir, I'm sure we can help you. Tell me about her. What's her taste? Cheap. Thank God. This ain't my wife we're talking about. <laughs> I don't know. I don't want to spend too much. I'm thinking maybe 10 grand. Our rings start at 8, our pendants start at 12. All right. So these things built to last, or am I just paying for the Vangelico logo here? <laughs> no, 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 no. We use perfect clarity jewels 18 karat gold, 950 platinum. Nothing but the best. All right. I think you just made a sale. I'm going to take a look around, think about it, come back to you, baby. Don't go anywhere. I understand. Okay. Thank you, sir. You got it. Come back to me. So, we good? Almost. I need to get eyes on the roof of the building. See where the ventilation comes out. Diet sodas are actually worse for you. Man, this dude goes way into detail in the darn scope and our place, doesn't he? Drive around the block and look for a way up to the roof. Find an access point. Like any kind of light, I, guess. I Look, there. Point. Some construction. Yeah, if they're gutting the place, I might be able to get to the roof. So, you keep up with the old crew? You know, after your death slash disappearance, there wasn't much holding us together. 
I saw a ladder. Climb up it and see if you can get to the roof. Yeah. You see him at all? After the incident? I kept tabs on him for a while. Needed to, uh, know that he didn't blame me. Yeah, where'd he go? North, south, east, west, wherever there were liquor stores to turn over and hitchhikers to disappear. I'm on the roof. All right, use the glasses to get me a shot of Angelico's roof unit. It'll be right above the store. Oh. Which one is that? Where did they bury him? They buried him? Not as far as I know. Hey, buddy. We're still running. He's probably a John Doe then, right? What do you think? OD? Shootout? Maybe just a car crash, right? Anonymous charred remains on the highway? They only knew what a sick puppy they had on their hands. I've pulled up a satellite image. It looks like the highest point is on the northwest side. Get a shot from there. Hey, I see the vents. Yeah, I'm looking at the relay. Can you get any higher? Uh. Ah! Well, that didn't work out. Not did it. He was supposed to catch, but he didn't catch. But of course, there's always a ladder somewhere. Well, I thought there was. It's like a big box on the roof. You've got a good vantage. Now use it and get an image of the air system. We've got our shot of the Vangelico unit. Looks good. Okay, that'll do. Now come back to me before someone spots you up there. Will do. Well, cool. someone oh. left a pink can. We're doing something pretty productive. There's a nail gun. Wow. That would be really cool to have. Wow. Climb Let's over the darn tape. Up, well. What do you think I'm doing, bub? I'm trying to hurry up. I'm trying to hurry up, guys. I'm trying. He's, he's pushing me. He's pushing my buttons. I'm gonna shoot him in the face. Here, take your glasses back. Let's go back to the garment factory. I called ahead and told him to start setting up the information. All right, and we're off. So, what did you see? Nothing that'll cause undue complications. Yeah, it looked like a simple setup. Cameras broadcasting through a remote server. We might be able to wipe with people. Security guard on the door. He won't want to die for rich assholes to rub his nose in it. Good. The alarm system's linked to the door lock. We'll get a good window. Someone talented hacks it. Anything else? Well, the uh, more valuable merchandise is in the cabinets in the center of the store, by the register. So I'd start there. Mm, glass in the cabinets was bulletproof. It means you can smash them easy enough, but the stones will be in the safe at night. So, we go in when it's open, then. Right. Once we melt down the gold, recut the rocks, that's an okay score. Yeah, shame we can't go in after hours, man. Those vents look promising. You might be able to flip that another way. I'm listening. Wait till we get back. About the crew. Yeah? There's this kid who's been helping me. Maybe we could cut him in. I don't work with amateurs. He ain't an amateur. Or if he is, he's a gifted amateur about to turn pro. He's a good kid, mm. Lester. Here are the photos. Uh, workers have their uses. Okay, let me set this up. <laughs> nice to see the methods haven't changed. Well, we gotta figure out what we're doing somehow. 
All the crews, the rolls, prep work. Don't want to leave evidence behind on a hard drive. So yeah, the uh, methods don't change. Right. Not for a pro. <laughs> well, mapping out the options, showing you all the angles. That's my area of professional expertise. But making decisions, that is your domain, my friend. Here. And there's two ways I see of doing this. We go in smart, or we go in loud and dumb. Remember the vents? If we're gonna be smart, we pump a little knockout gas through the air system, then hit the cabinets while everyone's out. You'll have to source the gas, of course, but crowd control won't slow you down, and that might improve the take. The cover is pest control, so no one will look twice when you're wearing gas masks. That means getting a pest control van, though. You go in dumb, and you'll need your, uh, famous way with people and four carbine rifles. But we can't buy them and risk them getting traced. No, 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 we've got to find some in circulation. It's awkward, it's, uh, <laughs> real awkward, but this is the gun favored by LS. PD tactical team, so one of their vans is probably a good place to look. A hacker can disable the cameras. The length of time depends on their ability. The alarm will be operating on the same window. The exit strategy is more or less the same for both options. The driver you pick will, of course, source some bikes. You come out of the store and make your way through the new subway tunnel they're digging off the Del Perro freeway. You lose the cops in there and meet a truck in the LS River. All right, I want my guy Franklin on the getaway. He can handle a bike. All right. If you vouch for him, I'll take the risk. So how do you want to do this? Run in through the front door or try to play it smart? Loud or smart? Um... Ah, you've grown wise and cautious in your old age. Okay. Select personnel with that in mind. As ever, the better they are, the bigger the cut. Now the driver, they'll source the bikes, lead you out through the tunnels. Eddie Cho. Now you can count on him to get you out of a spot. Guns. Now we're hoping to keep quiet, so this guy shouldn't make much difference. Gus Moda. He's a pro. Not much else to say. Hacker. Back office, but this is the person who will determine how long you get inside. Harris. <laughs> Good. Feminine touch. She'll be able to find any back doors they got. If this is how you want to do it, I'll get moving. Great. I'll do some research on the pest control van and the knockout gas, and I'll be in touch. Yes, huh? good, good. I'll call you when everything's ready. You'll need to pitch it to the guys. Whoa, what? My rep don't count for nothing no more. You're a dead man, Michael. I'll call you. Uh. Alright, let's go drive mission past. Alright. Well... Seems like we're just waiting on the call. So after this, we're hey, what's up? Know, hey, man, it's me, time. Michael. What's going on? Listen, um, I gotta get hold of the money for that house we pulled down. So, uh, I'm getting a crew together for, uh, you can guess. The pay will be awful, and the risk will be high. But you might learn something, if you're interested. Man, that's not exactly a great sales pitch, dog. but I guess I gotta start somewhere. Thank you. Maybe one day you can put together your own deals, your own jobs. So, there's still some preparation I gotta do. Sit tight for a while. My buddy Lester will get in touch with the details. All right, well, guys, I uh, hope you enjoyed this episode of the Let's Play. And the truck just scratched my truck, my car. Really nice. um, so, well. We'll see you guys in the next episode and catch you guys later. So, bye bye.